So we all know that backlinks are very important in SEO. But what is more important is that we know how good and how many backlinks do we have as well as our competitors so that we know if we have more or we have better backlinks we are going to rank above these competitors right so and we have the perfect tool to talk about today hey what up decisive marketers today we are going to be talking about seo spyglass right so this tool is by seo power suit and uh, they are one of the more you know prominent SEO companies uh, or SEO tool companies out there and we're going to test this out and see how good it is right but before I dive into SEO Spyglass be sure to hit the subscribe button if you like to see more e-commerce and digital marketing content right so here we go so here we are in SEO Spyglass so what I'm going to do is click on new and we are going to take a look at my own a website right here and uh, we're going to enable expert options right because hey i'm an expert <laughs> so let's jump in <coughs> okay so here we go uh we can also collect backlinks from our google analytics account so that's kind of cool so we can now connect to google which is very interesting let me take a look okay right i got to log in okay so it pulls in my google analytics data and then i can connect with google search console as well which is you know pretty cool right so hopefully that it doesn't take too long but yes definitely we are going to connect our tools so in the meantime let me see Okay, so I guess it'll take a little while. Let me just kind of pause the video a little while. Okay, so we are back now. Uh, and I've connected my GA4 account right here. So I click OK. And next thing is we are going to connect to Google Search Console, right? So I'm going to pause the video again. Okay, now it's connected. So I'm going to click on OK. And next so i can limit the number of backlinks that i want to retrieve okay so uh the thing to understand about seo spyglass right and you know i have done a video on website auditor previously uh the it is a powerful tool but the downside is that it is a desktop tool so it's going to use up the resources of your uh pc right so you know if you have too many backlinks that you're trying to pull out from here you're gonna have a lot of problems so i'm just gonna pull out say uh, a thousand for now right because i don't have a very very powerful computer right here so um with this okay so here we go so it has started to pull in the backlinks okay so here we go right so it gives me these data like i have 3735 backlinks uh, 336 uh, domains with about 40 40 percent of them being do follow so 133 domains and i have 218 ips okay let's see what is this okay looks like they want another verification here Okay, so that should have solved the issue. And then we can look at the um we can look at the uh you know like new backlinks this has came up. Okay, and then linking domains we've got stack market.
okay so it only has stack market over here okay so this is like today i think or the past month itself so see we won from july till date let's see if we have anything okay so we have these uh, domains that are connecting to us okay we got new link you know web fast data myth right a bunch of uh, sites that has linked to us okay so uh so here we can see like the backlinks and everything okay so backlink profile so this is an overview right so uh we can see like the backlinks that are linking to us so the domains are good but the pages uh, itself are pretty weak right and then uh, these are the you know so these are like the anchor tags uh linked pages so these are the ones that i link out to i guess okay and then uh we can take a look at like domain comparison so we can compare to another site so I don't really know who I'm I gonna compare with but see um, what do we have uh, what's a uh, what's a good let's let's see like smartmarketer.com okay, let's just gonna try that okay so we can see the domain strength is much stronger the 20 years running already mine is about five years they've got way more backlinks way more linking domains uh right and then way more backlinks as well okay so yeah so they've, they've got much stronger website of course right and then what is uh, link intersection so i guess it shows like which links they have that i don't which links uh, that they have that i do so this will be sort of like an opportunity for you like um so these are the links that he, they have so if i were to flip this around i guess these are the links that i don't have okay uh, and then I guess we can set to like do follow links as well and then we can see right so we can filter here so say we want the do follow links to be more than zero okay so then we can filter out the ones that don't matter and let's say we want to filter the in link domain in link rank is at least say because mine is like 45 i guess so we can set it to 45 and then this is what we have right some guy called chris michael harris and a bunch of other sites right here okay so next is bulk analysis so i can put in a bunch of websites in here and you know just kind of compare them all together and this is the domain strength like so so that is all okay right so indexing wise on google i have 290 pages while i have a lot more pages in yahoo and bing so i think that's actually very useful to know uh like you know the indexing like how many pages that you have um 
like do follow no follow i i think I'll, I'll, i mean these are very very useful feed um tools uh in the sense that su spyglass is kind of like ah reps right where you can actually look up the competitor backlinks right and then try and pull out the backlink data from them so that you can also get a link from the same uh you know site right so i guess that's all i have to share about seo spyglass i think for the price i mean as a desktop app itself uh you know it's you are saving a lot of money right you're saving a lot of money p rather than paying uh, a cloud service where you know like for example something like ahrefs cost you 100 over us dollars a month this is like i think you you know uh you only pay like whenever you whenever you need updates if i'm not wrong so uh it's definitely way much way more um, affordable than trying to you know get suckled in get sucked in into buying like is refs or semrush right uh with as used by glass you know uh it's got a very very nice uh ui i would say right and it's uh it seems like it's constantly updated as well so i don't see any reason why uh you know you should be paying for like Ahrefs and all that because uh, the data from here seems to be quite uh, you know quite detailed right probably not as good as Ahrefs of course but you know you are getting a very very good value for the price that you pay you just need you know a good computer right uh, which you should anyway right so anyway that's all i have to share about um su spyglass if you enjoy this video do give me a thumbs up let me know what you think about su spyglass in the comments below lastly if you know anyone who can benefit from su spyglass be sure to share this video with them i'll see you in my next video Bye bye